the world as we know today, we are engaging in the fourth industrial revolution. And we, we know that the usage of AI, AI to be implemented in everything that we do is becoming more and more significant. And we do know that Malaysia needs to be part of this fourth industrial revolution. And we know that with the enthusiasm of youth itself, we are going to propel for it. So uh, I'm asking, what will be the government's plans and initiatives to motivate youth to be more involved and engaged with the fourth industrial revolution itself? Obviously, we must have a good education system that stresses the need to know science and technology and mathematics. These are very important subjects for us to understand how artificial intelligence works. At the moment, of course, we are trying to, but uh, we are not still left far behind by many countries. Uh, we have uh, some help coming from Alibaba, for example. Uh, they have mastered the, uh, the essentials of the uh, artificial intelligence. We would like our, our schools to focus on that. But of course, uh, some people say that uh, we would be neglecting Islam. What has happened is that because we want uh, our people to know the religion, uh, the national school has become practically uh, Islamic school. They are not uh, focusing on the kind of knowledge that you need in order to adjust and accept new technologies. Uh, we are now trying to uh, draw up a new curriculum for the school. We will give proper attention to religion, but we cannot uh, expect everybody to become a priest or an ulama. Uh, what, work, what job will they take? We they don't understand the workings of new technology. But new technology also comes to us, not in our language. It comes to us in another language, mainly English, which is why we want to change the teaching of math and science in English. If you don't understand English, it's, you may know some basic science, but you will not know the, understand how to apply artificial intelligence in creating new products. So the government will now, uh, for, for religion also, they are not teaching the right religion. They are not teaching about how to be a good Muslim. They are sometimes quite divisive. Uh, that has to be corrected. But uh, we must focus on this new sciences, uh, in particular, the work of uh, the, in in the old days, when you have a television set, you have valves inside, big valves. They will light up inside. But nowadays, the valves have been reduced in size, so that on a microchip, a thousand valves can be printed on it. So, how does it happen? How how is it that you are able to print uh, transistors rather than uh, produce by in the old way. So our education system must uh, switch more towards uh, science and math without, of course, uh, uh, well, uh, disregarding religion. Religion will be taught, but in a proper way.